We back. Yes, yes, yes. We back. In the Hello. building. Hello, live chat. We need you. We need you. Maybe not so much because we're going to start off with Stale Berry's new song. Yes. The room. Yeah, it's exciting right now. And Stale he just dropping. dropped it like an hour ago, too. I'm sure, a lot of you guys are tuning in from the Philippines. So, good evening to those in the Philippines. All of y'all. Friday night. <laughs> what a great artist to start with uh, on a Friday night. You know, it's Friday morning for us, but I know on the other side of the world, it's a Friday night. And yeah. Still, Barry knows how to light up the night. Thank God it's Friday. Yes. Thank God it's Friday. Yes. Yes. Let's yeah. What a, what a way to start the weekend, right? Let's drop some new music, some new solo music that we haven't haven't I'm seen still. on Still yet. I've been anticipating this one. If he didn't drop the video, I would have watched the lyric video. But thank God he dropped off the video. So let's go. Rainy Friday on your side. Well, let's let's hope that uh, Stel can uh, brighten brighten the day, right? Yeah, they'll bring that sun out. <laughs> yeah, bring the sun out in the night. Let's go. Yeah, I'm excited, especially with a title like like Room, right? Yeah, it's almost like he's been listening to you and your uh, theater cool quest. Yeah, for Stel. <laughs> Yeah, he definitely, it definitely seems like, I mean, I've been saying that for a while that I, I think he should be doing some kind of music or something like that. He just has that, that kind of like vibe and he like, he, his voice is so perfect for it. He never done that in his youth. Like he's yeah. never been a theater kid. Which is crazy because like, yeah. he could have fooled me. Like I would have thought he definitely came up in this, especially with a voice like that, right? Like, he's been singing forever. In the Gravity song, like he was convinced he came like he was born in the theater you know what i mean <laughs> yeah i mean especially because look at his like song suggestions and stuff the songs that he usually like covers and stuff like that, a lot of them are like very theater type of songs right like he's doing a lot of like disney covers and he did like a lot of like songs from musicals like the gravity song that you're talking about right that's from uh wicked which is a musical so like even the ones that he was picking and i don't know if he was just purposely doing that or if those are the songs that he gravitated towards but those are like hard songs to do because those are like actual theater people that that's all they do is like sing. I think right? there's, there's nothing like Stell can't do. And the reason I'm saying it is because I heard him rap with Glock 9, phenomenal. I heard him sing that Lady Gaga one with Justin, you know, and we've heard all the different songs from SB19. So he's like super duper versatile. So I don't, I don't think he like, he cannot not do something, you know? I feel like he could do it all. Especially with his voice, because his voice is so unfair, you know? So, yeah. unfair to the rest of us. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's really fair to him. <laughs> 100%. We get, it looks like uh, it looks like a lot of these guys already checked it out, right? So, it seems like you guys are already trying to give us a little bit of spoilers, right? So people what? are saying... You guys all been in a room with Stel? I was expecting a ballad from Stel, but I'm still happy that he released a punk pop or well, Bruno Mars slash Michael Jackson. Mm, okay. Michael so, Jackson. So very pop poppy. Okay. Yeah. Bruno Mars is, is a monster for sure. And Stel embodies both of them in here. Michael Jackson and yeah, Bruno that, Mars. That's some high praise, right? Both Ooh. of those guys. Bruno Mars and Michael Jackson. Yes. You can't, yes. You can't go wrong with it with a combo like that, right? And now I'm super excited. We got to get into it, right? Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go. Let's All say. right, so we're going to do Stell, Room, the music video. Let's go. Stell oh, Barrett! Oh my goodness. I knew he was a movie star. Look at him. Good point. Near the stage, everyone. Why go in the mic?
Jackson, I could definitely see Bruno Mars, and I could definitely see Stout. What? This fits him so perfect. Yeah, so perfect. And yeah, and that girl in there, she like she she's about to like go. <laughs> she losing it, you know? All even, of them in the room. Right? I know. Even the males were sweating. They were like, "Oh my god, y'all, what is this?" <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. That's no, crazy. I lo- I love the concept of how he even started the video too. It's just like. Is like an open mic, but it's almost he's like auditioning the show like like yeah. they were already rehearsing right on stage, and they're like, oh look who's this guy that's gonna come in here and they're just like, I guess we gotta stop. Let's listen to this guy real quick. Yeah. And it looked like they're trying to give him a chance, right? They're like, oh yeah, he's just gonna come up here. I know. He's probably uh, not gonna be great. Hey. Well, at the beginning, she kept like rolling her eyes, like, oh my god. Oh, yeah, my. here's another audition, right? It's probably yeah. like it, it, it seemed like they're getting just a bunch of people that were showing up that like one. You know, wowing them, and then he comes in there and changes the whole room, yeah. literally room. And what's really like dope is like the fact that that's sort of how SB19 started too, with auditions and behind the scenes, and you know what I mean. Like keep working at it, and it's funny. Like that's what this uh, music video is about. That's really yeah. dope. What a debut, right? This is like perfect for Stell. Like, yo, what a video too, man. The yeah. video, fire, fire. And the instrumental is fire. I love the instrumental. The instrumental brings me like to Michael Jackson a lot. He's obviously killing the vocals as usual. The lyrics are nice too, though. You know, yeah, it's a it's a nice little pop hit, right? It's yeah. it's very very catchy already. Um, I love even like when he was doing like the stuff in in the background too of his own voice, and then he was like actually like made it seem like he was like whispering to them in the audience, right? Yeah. He was like performing on stage, but then he was also like whispering to them, so it made it seem like he was everywhere in the room, right? Yes, it's like you couldn't <laughs> escape him, right? Just like you can't escape his voice, like when he when he's yeah. like singing and stuff like that. It's like surround sound. It's like it surrounds you. So I thought that was really cool that he was like whispering behind them <laughs> as he was singing and doing his performance. Yeah, that was, was kind of cool. He's killing it, man. He like right off the rip, he looked like he could easy be a movie star, like easy, easy. You know, yeah. he already looks like a movie star. You know, so the theater, movies, music. I mean, Staleberry is going places. Let's go. Yeah, Let's I feel like he was, he was definitely listening to us, right? Like I feel like a yeah. lot of the stuff that we were excited and we wanted to see him like, do. Good ideas. Good ideas. He kind of he kind of took that and ran with it with this with this yeah. video, right? He was yeah. like, "Oh, you guys think that I would do theater and stuff like that?" He's like, "I'll show you guys." 
He's like, right? good point, good point. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, no, he's killing it though. Like I, I like it. I like the style. I like yeah. seeing him being able to like dance and show off here a little bit. What I love the most is like that he gets to do it like solo, you know. Like I understand, like of course I want him with SB19. I never want him to leave SB19, but like it's really refreshing to see him solo doing this thing the way he wants to do it, you know. And that's yeah. what I feel like in here. So yeah, man. Shout out to Stellberry. Let's get some fires in for Stellberry. Let's go. It looks like from the comment section, it looks like a lot of people are saying that Pablo helped write the song. Josue helped with the production. And then um, somebody was saying something about Justin as creative director of the music video. Yeah. So Yo, like, he's getting help from his brothers, man. That's, that's why what I'm like, saying, yeah. That's why the team is so strong that they, they can bring their ideas to life. And that's what's beautiful about it. Stellberry can shine, you know? Yeah. Yo, but he's a movie star though for certain. Yeah. Even him just walking up to the theater and stuff like that, like, yeah, this is very cinematic. Right. Yeah. He, I love that he like really went into that that realm. Him just walking up. He had the post in his hand, everything. It was like it this bring me back to like an old Michael Jackson like music video. Yeah. Like, that kind of vibes. Right. It was like a little story in the beginning before it starts off. And it's like that anticipation, like, well, what's going on here? Right? What are we about to see? Uh, auditions are such a big deal for singers, so like that's that's so dope he, he did it perfectly too because I, I know a lot of people who who did come up in like doing musical theaters and stuff like that and i've actually seen a lot of people like who've, who've done auditions and stuff like that and this is kind of really like accurate with like how it kind of is like when you show up to like auditions and stuff like that a lot of times that's the kind of reaction you usually get initially until they can see what you could do yes. yeah, every time is usually because you're not usually the first person that they've seen right usually when they're doing auditions they're seeing like hundreds if not maybe th depending on the part or whatever you're trying to do right? especially an open call like that they're probably getting hundreds if not thousands of people are going up there saying like oh yeah i got a talent i can sing i can do this so eventually they start looking like that they start being yeah. like oh my god we don't have nobody that has talent here and then when you get somebody like <laughs> who actually has talent right and that shows up and blows up the stage then it's Very like different. everybody else is like whoa hold on what are we watching right now and auditions like them rolling their eyes during the audition is it's normal really because you don't know what the person got if you knew what they have they wouldn't even be in the audition you would have just called them to do it you know what i mean yeah. so but what a debut man like i love it like I, this is showing a lot that still could do by himself it's showing that he's he's definitely a front man for sure which we kind of already kind of knew for but movies, this, that's this what is, I'm excited about is movies because yeah. he just like seems like he's gonna be like a top notch actor. Yeah, top like notch it. actor. There's the only answer. This energy that's within me won't ever let you scared. Diamond is so pretty. I see me flow in your body. Picture perfect movie, trembling frills me. I don't want an ending. Savor every bit of it, cause we're not. You know when he did that little chair thingy when he was like standing on a chair and tipping it over i want to see the behind the scenes i want to see if he really did that that's whoo that's fire yeah he said turned into a little magic mic little scene for a second right a little, little berries and aids all <laughs> represented oh my yeah. goodness 
I'm not surprised that he, he had a little dance break in there. Stella's the real deal, man. Stella's the real deal. I got so much Michael Jackson feeling in that one. He was doing a lot of ad libs and stuff too. Like what he was even doing the, the like yeah. when, even when he was breathing, right? He was like incorporating that in the song too. And yeah. then he even like did the little yelling too for a second. Yeah. Right? Like, well, like what Michael Jackson kind well, of. Well, where's the end, right? Yes, yeah. yes, 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 100%. But yeah. that chair move was crazy looking though. And so unique too. That was very, uh, very unique. I've only seen probably like Jackie Chan do something like that, you know? Where you tipping over the, the, the chair. chair and letting it fall. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. But you but you like walking on it, you know? It's fire, y'all. Let's get some fires on the chat. Let's yeah. go. I've seen stuff like that like in like Broadway shows and stuff like that. Cause it's very like theater. He incorporated a lot of stuff on the, the stage. Right, so that's yes. why I'm like, this guy needs to hurry up and do like a Broadway show because this guy's already doing Broadway shows in his music videos already, right? I seen somebody else put in here that he wants to do Broadway, and that would, yeah, I could definitely see this guy doing a Broadway show for sure. I love the style for him though, like it fits him perfect, you know. Yeah, teasing the ladies, like making music like this, it's like perfect for Staleberry. Like this is this is what he's made for, you know. And his high notes are so ridiculous, yo. When he when he grabs the mic and just like goes all out, like yo, you can't, you can't, you can't compete with that, you know. You just yeah. can't. It's just phenomenal. Nah, he turned he turned into a different. He turned into a superhero, right? He came in there like all quiet looking, looking like he wasn't gonna do nothing. And all of a sudden, he gave a full performance. He even had that like that girl was like losing her mind the whole time. Then he, even though he had her, the other ones were coming too. Yeah. He almost wanted a fighter over him, you know what I mean? But now I felt like he came in sort of confident, you know? He put his hands in his pocket. And he's like, I don't think you know what you're dealing with, you know? And like yeah. sort of just walked into the stage. Oh man, it's just phenomenal, yo. Staleberry's the man. Killed it. All English too on top of that. The instrumental was fire. The lyrics were fire. The whole concept of reading the room. It's obviously, you know what, it's, it's basically Moonlight Part 2. This is a very fun video and a very fun song as well, you know? Great yeah, song. Great, great introduction to his solo stuff. Right away, immediately, he came out with just like a hit. Just to yes. show everybody, like, hey, I could do this, like... And I'm sure I'm, I'm excited to see how like I could we know how versatile like he really is right with the different t types of styles he could do and all the different things like the way his voice can get to. I'm excited to see like what other songs that he's actually got as a solo artist. But it's cool to see like right out the gate he's just like I can make a hit. Let me just show these guys like right away. Let me let me yeah. show you guys I can make a radio pop hit right out the gate. That's yes. I, I, this already sounds classic. Somebody said that he's gonna be releasing his EP soon. Really? Yeah. Right, so that means that means we're definitely gonna be getting some more singles. Some more music, I'm sure, before that that drops. Yeah. That's hopefully, music. Sigma. Hopefully, hopefully that's the case. Let's go. He deserves it. Cause you know he got a point. He got a point. <laughs> yeah. He's gonna make that point. <laughs> yeah, I wanna that's see I wanna see more visual stuff too. So I hope if it, if he's dropping this EP, I hope it comes with more more visuals for us. Like more of these yeah. music videos, more of these, because I, I feel like this really like ties it together. I really like that he immediately, his first song that he he dropped a music video for it right out the gate. I would love to see him in a movie after watching this. <laughs> I think he could do big things in the movie scenes for certain. Yeah. No, great, he got the look, he, he got everything, you know, the charisma, his energy, period, you know, it's, it's, it's made for that. It's made for entertainment on all aspects. So, yeah, theater movies music what you can't fail and sb19 1z entertainment is backing them up as well so you can't lose you know you got your yeah. brothers with you i mean they're doing big things man shout out to all of them for certain and staleberry of course staleberry killing i'm so surprised though honestly i didn't think it was gonna well it was called Room, so I assumed it was going to be some English. I didn't assume the entire thing to be this English. Song. And, and the Same. sound, I wasn't expecting to be like such a, you know, bringing Michael Jackson back. Yeah. But it fits him, though, because he's a uh, choreographer, too. So, like, obviously, he's a great dancer. So, it, it fits. Yeah. It fits. Like, he even had a bunch of different moments in here. Like, that That really reminded me of, like, an older type of music, which I think is why it feels so classic already. Because he like had like the dance break in there, right? He had like these certain things that like people don't do in music anymore. That's why I think we are getting this Michael Jackson Bruno Mars vibe because it's very like the the song structure. It's very like 
like older style, right? Well, a lot of people don't don't really structure the music old like school with a, like a new school video, you know? <laughs> Correct. Yeah. 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 So it's really smart, and really smart on his part. Like I think I think his team and everybody around him. I mean, they already got it's an oiled machine, right? They they got a lot going for them already with having SB19. But I think this was really smart for them to like come out like this first because we already know what Stell can actually do singing wise. So I don't think it, like nobody's questioning his voice, right? Nobody, yeah, knew, no, we we all knew that he was going to sound He's great not the vocally. Voice. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So he, so it was dope to see that like right out the gate, like, hey, I'm going to give you guys a hit first. So you guys can kind of see what I can do by myself that I can hold it down by myself. So that, that was really and cool. Diddy, and goodness oh, gracious. Yeah, he did. Yeah. 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 And yeah. multiple levels, right? And right. I want I want to see him in movies, man. I'm telling you, man. I want to see him in movies. It just seems like he's, he's gonna do really, really well in movies. And you know how like uh, militant he is, and how like you know obsessively works at his craft. So can you imagine like if he's working on a role, he'll mm -hmm. probably be on a role in the Hollywood scene. You know, he'll probably make it to America in the Hollywood scene. Honestly, I mean he has all the tangibles that you need to do that. You know, yeah. and obviously the voice too. On top of that, that's why the theater idea is great too. And somebody, I think in the comment section, I might be wrong, guys, but somebody said that he auditioned for some theater role and like they denied him. The nerve, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, that's what somebody said in the comment. I don't know how much facts is in it, but that's what I heard, which is crazy. I would think, I would think he'd be doing the auditions to to find the characters. You know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah. it is what it is no his future his future is bright man like mm -hmm. and he's still so young like he's got he's got so many avenues that i know that he can he can go but either way man i'm, I'm excited to see what he's gonna drop for it like whether it's a lot more solo stuff or more stuff with sp19 all the stuff that he does like man, i'm i'm a fan so i yeah. i love it and i love that, that we're getting to see like a, a little bit more shine from him right being able to be solo like this but yeah everything that he does everything he's associated with so far like he hasn't he hasn't messed oh. with me did you just hear that? Yo, look at this. Stell told his fans that he auditioned, but it turns out it was actually the setup for Room. Mm. So, so, so the 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 fans that were commenting on our video, he, he like uh, he played a oh, trick. Yeah, so on it, was, the, it was a prank for a his joke. solo yeah. announcement. Okay, that's funny. wow. That's so funny. That's cool. I, I can see that, right? And then it's and then yeah. everybody's like, "Oh my god, he didn't get it. He didn't get the part." <laughs> no, because I, I was really mad about that. You know, like I wanted to like protest about that because how dare yeah. you? You know, but wow, that makes a lot of sense though. That's cool. <laughs> he was lying to the fans. <laughs> <laughs> Man, let's go. Cool. But what what a promotion, right? Because it, it got everybody riled up as soon as you talk about like something like that. Like it riled everybody up who's beating still in a room like like when you're auditioning like voice wise <laughs> was, was he sick it's, it's, <laughs> right? you, you can't beat him and then like dancing you can't beat him because he's a choreographer and with work ethic you can't beat him neither you know what i mean yeah. so like there's nothing that he's lacking on so he'd be really 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 yeah you're gonna have to be like that guy to be competing yeah. with him, you, you know? gotta be a superstar, right? You gotta. Be You're gonna have to audition man. to be competition. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah, hundred percent. But no, shout out great. to Stale Berry, absolutely killed it. Yeah, he brought Michael Jackson back to life, and I appreciate that. I love Michael Jackson. Super, let's get some fires on the chat for Stale Berry. Let's go. Yeah, let's he, go. he came. He came in for his yes. debut. And I hope his uh, EP comes out too. That would be super duper dope. Super yeah, duper. Yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy for Stell, man. Really happy. I'm really happy that he he's getting the recognition and what a debut. Like I feel like this is just more anticipation to see what else he's he's gonna be coming out with.